Cinematopical back for a, another video. I am Strange Wang. Smokey the Bear is otherwise known as Anthony. And that down there is Nate. And uh, yeah, we're watching the Spider Man Far From Home trailer. I'm not the biggest comic book fan, but Spider Man, he's already in my book. So let's check this out. Far From Home trailer is about to play, but if you haven't seen Avengers Endgame yet, Stop watching because there's some serious spoilers about to come up. Nice but if you have seen Avengers Endgame, enjoy the trailer. See, that's nice Everywhere I go, I see his face. Oh. I just really miss him. Yeah, I miss him too. I don't think Tony would have done what he did if he didn't know that you were going to be here after he was gone. <laughs> You gonna be the next Iron Man now? Well, no, I don't have time. I'm too busy doing your jobs. Oh. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Look, keep up the good work because I am going on vacation. Heads up, Nick Fury is calling you. I don't really want to talk to Nick Answer Fury. Phone. Why? Because if you don't talk to him, then I have to talk to him. I don't want to talk to him. You sent Nick Fury to voicemail? I gotta go. You do not ghost Nick Fury. What up, dorks? What's up? We're just talking about the trip. I'm here in St. Marco Polo. Oh, I think MJ really likes me. That reminds me when I first fell in love. You're a very difficult person to contact, Spider-Man. This is Mr. Beck. I could use someone like you on my world. Your world? Beck is from Earth, just not ours. The snap to our hole in our dimension. You're saying there's a multiverse? We have a job to do. You're coming with us. There's got to be someone else you can use. What about Thor? Off-world. Captain Marvel. Unavailable. But I'm just a friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Bitch, please. You've been to space. What do you want, Peter? I want to go back on my trip with the girl who I really like and tell her how I feel. MJ, I am Spider-Man. No, of course I'm not. I mean, it's... Kind of obvious. You're right, you may not be ready, but this is my responsibility. Saving the world requires sacrifice. Sometimes people die. Oh my god. I just always feel like I'm putting my friends in danger. The world needs the next Iron Man. Are you going to step up or not? Spider-Man? You work for Spider-Man, not for Spider-Man. <laughs> New plan. <laughs> I got beef. <clears throat> One thing before I get on my rant. Yeah. I love Spider-Man. Mm -hmm. These movies are well made, even though to me, like I don't connect with the characters all the time, and it's like very repetitive. The where am I? English motherfucker, do you speak it? Well made. So the Mysterio Hill turn on Spider-Man is gonna be great. Because these movies, when they do do turns that you already know from comic books, they are well done. They're very good. So I can't wait for that. Spider-Man is going to be in the film. I'm going to love it. I'm going to enjoy it. The action scene was great. He's quippy. As we saw with the cops. So I'm really going to love this movie. But I got beef. Ned was not blown away by the snap. So he was still on Earth. Five years later. I was in high school four years. Ned's a smart motherfucker. He should have been done with school. Why is he on the school trip? I understand Spider-Man if you got blown away, like, you gotta finish school, or you'll be stupid. But most of them motherfuckers, they didn't get blown away, so they should've finished school. Why are they on a school trip when they should've been done with school already? So you're not gonna buy into that? Well, I'm not buying that shit at all. Because that was my one thing. I love uh, I love in-game, but afterwards it was like, so uh, are these people going to get their jobs back, or they have to reapply? Like, the I'm, logistics. Yeah. I'm not asking you this in, like, a trying to prove wrong way. I really don't know. Yeah. So, like, did you look up beforehand that Ned got snapped away? Like, do you know? It was in the movie. Well, I don't remember. Ned, yeah. No, you remember with me? He didn't, he didn't get snapped <clears throat> away. Okay. All the Spider-Man stuff I paid more attention to because all the Spider-Man. All right, well, what if, like, 
So literally, like, they half, didn't go to school for five years. Half the world got snapped away. Do you think they just like presumed normal operation and had people going to school and yes. stuff? If half the did, population disappeared, and they like, went on dates within one year. They just like Anthony got Russo, the entire school system back Anthony, together. Anthony Russo went on a date. So motherfuckers dating. They can fucking... Bruh, learn. I'm going to be trying to make some love connections way before I'm going to be worried about finishing my education when half the world disappears. I give it like you get like a year <laughs> off. A year off. Okay. They're, they're already sophomores or juniors in high school. So five years they should have been done with school. Or Ned at least should have been done with school. 2,000 years later. But like they're going to explain that. Well, until they explain it, I got beef. Like that's too big to not explain. Like my dick. Also... Like, got it from my dad. I'm not hanging on to it as fact, but like, I would six and a half hours later. I wouldn't be su- I w- I would not be surprised if. All right, here's my thing. I think there's a sixty percent chance that Mysterio doesn't turn heel. That's a twist all on itself. In this in this movie, at least, I would be happier with that. I would too. And but they did it with the scroll in Captain Marvel. They were the good guy. They like yeah, completely true. flipped. True, yeah, true, like true. so. I think that he will be a villain at some point, but I would not be surprised if it was not in this movie. Which I like. I like it a lot. What do you think, Tiffany? Um, I have probably over the past like two or three months really started to enjoy more superhero movies than I than I ever have. And I noticed every time uh <clears throat> the sound effect of those uh, spider things, you got really excited. Is that a reason why you're looking forward to those movies? I am enjoying the escapism that that superhero movies is giving me. Versus, like, because I feel like I'm so drawn to like character driven. Yeah, so we're the comic characters. Whack. (laughs) Um, I have really, really loved some of that escapism that I've been able to get, and I'm looking forward to this one. Yeah. Word. I feel like I go into it because with like these movies, I don't go into it with these high expectations, and I don't go into it with like this history of like I've read all these comic books and I know everything that's supposed to happen, and I like understand this world fully. So I think I go into it with a lot more um, of just like I'm just going to buy into whatever this particular movie is offering, and so I think that mm-hmm. that's led me to enjoy a lot of them more, and I'm not maybe as critical. That's definitely as a very good are. point. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm really, really excited because, like, I will watch this movie and I'm just going to be like, this is amazing. And I'm not going, because I'm still catching up on all of them, I'm not going to be drawing all those connections mm-hmm. and I'm just going to like it for what it is. Yeah. That's actually a good point. What about you? No one cares. Him dealing with the loss of his father figure and Tony Stark. Yeah. Like, that stuff with him and Happy in the beginning was, like, super touching. Um, and, like, I mean, and, like, you get my the connection I have with Iron Man and stuff like that. Yeah. Even though it, it kind of died out and it's, huh. it's like him. Yeah. <laughs> I like the 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 dad stuff, and I want more of that. That's, cool. That's what we think about the <laughs> first trailer. Well, not the first one because we got a teaser, but the first official trailer for Spider Man: Far From Home. Let us know what you think down in the comments below. Let us know what you think Mysterio is going to be. Is he going to be a bad guy? Is he not going to be a bad guy? I don't know. Maybe you do. Like, comment. Hey! Subscribe.